morning. It is Thursday today. It's about 10 o'clock and I decided to sit here, talk to you guys, drink my coffee, and just have a very nice relaxing morning. I woke up at about 7, 7.30 today and I was supposed to go to the gym but I didn't because I was a little tired. I just now actually started going back to the gym because about three weeks ago, I think it was three, yeah, probably three weeks ago, I was working out, I was doing deadlifts and something tore a little bit in my hamstring. A slight tear, it wasn't like, it didn't snap or anything like that, but uh, I think it was a slight tear. So I've basically been resting for about three, three to four weeks, but I finally, now I'm getting back to working out again and it feels really good. Um, it did kind of suck though because now I'm like back at square one. Before I got injured, I was actually enjoying going to the gym a lot. I was having fun. I wanted to go. I saw and felt changes in my body and now it's like, let's go back to square one, start over. I know I can do it. I just got to tell myself to go do it again um, because I actually did really enjoy it and it was fun but for right now though I've been I'm just gonna try to take it very slow very lightweight sometimes not even any type of weights um, just because I don't want to get injured again but we're getting back into it I'm gonna go to the gym a little bit later but just not right now but we did go on a walk though me and my boyfriend we did go on a walk this morning by the beach and it was really nice you could feel that it's starting to become fall because it's colder in the morning two months ago like two three months ago during the summer it was even though like, like the mornings are a little bit like chillier you could still feel that it was hot like it was warm but now it's actually cold it's still sunny but it's that light chilly refreshing air and I really like it it wakes you up a little bit but yeah we did that and came home I made some breakfast and got my coffee I only have two more months of school and then I'm on winter break which is gonna be nice it's gonna feel good get a break and during my winter break I um, like I told you guys in the last video I am going to Sweden me and my boyfriend are going to Sweden it's his first time in Sweden it's clearly not my first time, but I'm excited. It's going to be fun. It's going to be rainy, but I honestly have no issue with that. Um, it'll be fine. We're going to be out there for two weeks, and I think it's going to be really, really fun. Show him my place and my where I grew up and like what schools I went to and things like that. And then just for him to explore and see new places in Europe. And then also to just see family and friends and things like that that I haven't seen since last time I was in Sweden. Speaking of Sweden, I was thinking that I might do some videos in Swedish. I don't know. I I started my channel in English and I'm, I'm probably not going to switch 100% over to Swedish, but... I thought it might be like a little fun thing because I think the majority of my viewers are from Sweden and it's just like it's a part of me it's a huge part of me and I think it'd be a, a fun switch up maybe let me know in the comments below if you guys think that would be a good idea just like every once in a while I'll do like a Swedish vlog I think it might be fun and it's like I very rarely speak Swedish nowadays the only time I do speak Swedish is when I'm hanging out with my sister, for example, we always speak Swedish, or if I'm on the phone with my parents or my friends and stuff like that. But the majority of the times, I just speak English. Like in school or with my boyfriend and in the stores, it's mostly English. But I don't know, I might, might do some videos in Swedish. But you guys let me know in the comments if you guys think that would be a good idea. I know it's like 10 o'clock and I said good morning, but 
first of all, I didn't wake up just now. I woke up like two, three hours ago. And I really like being a little slow in the morning and just enjoying the morning. You know, like having my coffee, having my breakfast, um, and just relaxing. There's no need to stress in the morning. There's no need to like do any of that. So I like taking my time in the morning. And usually if I like put makeup on and get ready and things like that, love taking time doing that not stressing just relaxing there's no need to stress why not just sit here sit in bed enjoy my coffee and just talk to you guys for a little while like i said it is getting colder out now and i really really like it because like i like when it's hot out don't get me wrong i do like it you can go to the beach it's nice and all that but when it's hot all the way throughout like September and like start of October, it's a little much and it's just not comfortable anymore, you know? Um, I like wearing hoodies, I like wearing long pants and things like that. So then now that it's getting colder, I can do that. I'm happy we have this apartment. Literally like almost every single day we're always just like, this is like a nice place and like we're happy we have it. Um, it feels really good to have our own place and it's fun and we're obviously still like organizing everything We haven't fully Got into all of that yet part of that is because We need to get like a little bookshelf thing for the living room and Ikea is literally sold out almost everywhere the closest one that we could pick it up at is in Covina, which is like on a good day when there's no traffic it's at least 30 minutes if not like an hour and that's a little too far to pick up a bookshelf so we're honestly just waiting until it gets in store and in stock in the stores around us we have one a little bit south and then one a little bit north from us so we're gonna i i'm always like on the ikea app to see if it's in stock yet Hasn't been in stock for a little while, so we're just waiting for that, and then we can organize a little bit more. But for the most part, though, I have to say that we have it pretty organized. We have our clothes organized, and just, like, things that, you know, smaller things. We have it pretty organized, shoes, things like that. But it's, it's a process, obviously. It takes a little while to fully get established and organized, but we're getting there. Like I said, we are getting there. We're not too far away from having it fully organized yet, but exciting though some exciting news though is that I am most likely like 99% certainty I'm gonna have classes on campus next semester which is exciting because everything has been online for a year and a half it's gonna be like two years almost and although it's nice it is exhausting it's tiring it's boring so in the spring, my classes, um, pretty much all of them, are going to be on campus, which is going to be exciting. It's going to be fun. It's going to be a little weird going back to on-campus stuff and on-campus schooling after, you know, almost two years of online. I've, I've been to my campus, my school campus, like the bookstore and the library and things like that, but I've never had class over there. And it's a pretty big campus so I'm gonna have to figure that out and where everything's at but I'm excited though meet new people just have a more full like college experience it's not the same when you're just at home on a computer all day it's really not the same but being on campus and just experiencing all that I think it'll be fun other than that life is nice um, I don't have a lot going on right now, which is kind of nice, honestly. It's nice to just enjoy my new area, and I was, um, when we were on the walk earlier today, I was like, this is really, like, nice. I like our area. I like the, you know, the place that we live in, and I think that's really important. Um, I think that affects your mood and your emotion and your feelings a lot. Um, outside forces like that, I think, really do affect how you feel, and, I am very happy being here. I I really like 
the diversity that's out here i really like that there's a lot of things to do um yeah i'm just like really happy where with where i'm at i hope that whatever you guys are doing and wherever you're living at whatever your job is or school or whatever you're doing i hope that you guys are happy with it and content with it and that it brings you happiness and peace because i think that's really really important I think we need to make sure that we do things that make us happy and that we are around people that make us happy because that happiness is important and it's important to listen to yourself and to what you want and what you don't want and just take it from there. I hope that you guys have an amazing week. Make sure that you spend time with yourselves and with people that you like and do something that makes you really happy and i will see you guys in the next video thank you guys for spending this morning with me have a great week bye